What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Titus with Vin Valley Mercenaries and I'm here today on behalf of Final Approach's new decoys for this year. I think you guys are gonna love it. I don't even care if you're from the West Coast and you're around where these are at. You guys might just wanna buy these decoys just to hang on the wall as a collector's item. When I first seen these a few months ago before they were out on the market, I was like, hey, I wanna just grab one of those and put it up on my wall so I could have like a collector's item and that is Final Approach's new cinnamon till. Let's check them out. Guys, if you've been around long enough and seen the decoy market, there has been tons and tons of decoys, but I have never seen decoys like this that are such have such an amazing paint scheme and have such an amazing look to them and something that's gonna add a lot of pop in your spread, and that is Final Approach's new cinnamon teal. Get that first glance at these. I'm telling you right now, you will admit by looking at these right now that this looks like something that you would buy at, at Dex Unlimited or Delta Waterfowl event. The paint scheme, the colors, the look, it's something you could put up on your wall, honestly. If you want to leave it on the kill or cut the kill off and put it on a little pedestal, look at that. So right now, you can get these on fabrand.com on the website for 100 bucks for a 12 pack of cinnamon till. It comes with eight drakes and four hens. The hens are the same as the blue wings and the green wings. If I can grab one out of here. So they've got the low feeder head. Same thing, you'll get four of these hens and then you'll get eight Drake cinnamon till. And I love that, that's what I really like about Final Approach and a lot of guys are going around saying that. Guys and girls are saying, hey, one thing I like about what Final Approach is doing is that they're putting more Drakes than hens. And the reason we like that is because the Drakes are the ones with the color and they're the one that brings the pop to the spread. They also sell the Spoonies in a pack of all Drakes. I love that. That's what brings color to your spread and that's one of my favorite things, how Final Approach is doing things. They are the hunter's advocate. These guys are true hunters. These guys have spent 30, 40 years in the field and they know. They're not some guys that haven't been out in the field and spent time out there hunting and hours and hours and think, seeing how birds react to things. You guys, that means a lot to me. That honestly is the biggest reason I like Final Approach so much is because the guys behind the product know what works. I've always said that for years, like why, I don't need so many hens. And there may be different opinions of that, but from the air, if you look at any drone shots, guys, you're gonna see that from above, the hens just do not stick out the same. I'm not saying I don't want hens in my spread. All I'm saying is I want the pop. The guy that carved these this decoy out is Wayne Simpkin. He's a world champion uh, decoy carver and he did such a phenomenal job. And I'll keep trying to show you guys some real good close up shots of these decoys. And um, I can't wait to use them this year in the spread. Let me say this, will these bring cinnamon till into my spread? I'm not gonna say they will. I'm not gonna say they won't. The last few years we have been shooting more cinnamons than normal. I think it has a lot to do with the weather patterns and what how things have been happening. Um, usually they're past us by the time our season opens this year. We've been getting on to him for the last couple of years, but it's hit and miss. I'm never going out there thinking, oh, I'm going to go shoot a bunch of cinnamon till, but we have done our damage on him. And I think this will be a great addition to any decoy spread, including my own, and I'm excited to use them. One more thing about these, it does have three anchor points. You can put it in the middle, the back, or the front. Um, they've just got a good feel to it. They're not too hard. They are a high quality premium plastic um, that will hold up and is durable. And um, I can tell you what, I beat the snot out of my uh, Final Approach decoys last year and they held up, paint did not chip, paint did not fade, none of that. Um, I just really wanted to see what I could put them under and see the pressure they could take. But this year I'll be trying to baby them a little bit more when I can. But you know how we duck hunters are. We, we uh, abuse our stuff. So I believe these will hold up because it's the same paint, just like the other ones. 
If you're worried about chipping and, and like I said, these are so pretty, you almost want to be careful with them, put a clear coat on them, you know? If you want to put a clear coat of matte or semi-gloss, whatever, on these, just to make sure they stay safe all season long. Guys, check them out. And also, while you're picking these up at fabrand.com, check out Final Approaches Coated Steel Texas Rigs. They are by far my favorite, by far, bar none, the favorite rigs I've ever used. They're coated steel cable and the weights move there's so many different sizes and ounces and links you guys will love it go check them out fabrand.com we'll see you guys on the next video